I used to have a stiff and tight lower back. And while this was good for performing heavy compound movements, it's not great for your ability to move freely without restriction. Ideally, you want a lower back that has the ability to create stiffness and rigidity. While also maintaining the ability to flex and extend without pain. We can attack that doing two things. Number one, tight hamstrings can contribute to that lower back pain. So try elephant walks. Stand up, lower yourself down as far down as you can go, pause wherever you're at, and go ahead and bend one knee, straighten it all the way out, and then switch to the other side. By doing this, you're gonna stretch those hamstrings and you're also gonna get some nerve flossing in. You also wanna strengthen the hamstrings at length. So if you have a backpack or some type of weight at home, you can do what we call a Romanian deadlift. Start here, keep the back straight, come down, and then if you have a surface that you can stand on, you can do deficit RDLs to bring more length to the hamstrings. Then we can attack the lower back directly with cat-cow flexion and extension of the lower back on all fours. And if you want, you can even add weight for a movement like the seated Jefferson curl. Stay flexy.